Okay, so this is just a quick first look at Adobe Character Animator, which is actually a super cool software. So when you open it, the first thing you're going to see is that you have this character in the middle, and it's probably moving and doing things according to how you're talking, which is kind of weird. And so I'm going to show you how that works. But first, as you can see, it's organized much like other Adobe softwares. At the top, you have your scene, your puppet, and like a welcome guide. And over on the left, you have your project files. Now for this to work, you need a camera because it's actually tracking your face movement. And to show you this, you just go up to window and camera and microphone. And as you can see, I'm right there now. And if you want to track your face, you just go down here to set rest pose and click it. And now you can see all these dots on her face that look like animation from movies. And that's because it's actually tracking the movements of your mouth, your eyes, and your eyebrows. And so you can see right here, if I raise my eyebrows, they raise on the character. And the same thing goes with eyes. If I look around, the eyes go around, the mouth opens, the head turns, everything's directly proportional and accurate in that sense. The only thing that doesn't work is like turning your head, that just loses the track and doesn't affect the character. They also have like a hundred different mouth expressions, so when it hears a certain sound, it moves the mouth in a way sort of similar to that. You also have the ability to move the character and kind of shape how it's acting in your scene along with the voice. So that's really cool. Now if you want to record something into the scene, you just click this little record button down here and you can start it. This is just a test of the character and how it works in Character Animator from Adobe. Once you've recorded the little shot here, you have all this information including the eye gaze, the face, the lip sync, dangle, transform, all sorts of things you can affect and animate later. You can see it's not perfect, but for a software that's just using the webcam and the computer, it works pretty well. Of course you can change how your character looks in Photoshop and add backgrounds and animate everything to it, but this is just a super simple look on how it can track your face and project it onto a character in Character Animator.